Wes, they had an 11-0 run in the third that got them back into the game. What did they do differently to sort of change that game in the second half? Yeah, I thought, um, you know, we knew that they were going to amp up their pressure a little bit and the level of physicality. Um, you know, it, it bottled us up a bit, forced us, you know, extended our catches. We still got a lot of great looks at the rim. I think we were, you know, four for 12 in that fourth in the paint. We just couldn't convert. So we were able to still get uh, decent looks. Uh, of course, they just, you know, they didn't go for us. You know, you talked about the fourth. You guys went the last seven seven minutes and 25 seconds of the game without a field goal. Was it a reflection of the offense just not being able to get things going? Was it their defense? Like, what, what was A little bit of both. Yeah, I think, you know, their defensive pressure. Um, like I said, we were able to get, you know, rim attempts. You can't really buy a better shot than that. I mean, find a way to convert some of those. Um, you know, a handful of turnovers. But a um, combination of those, those three, really. Was Gafford um, uh, available down the stretch, or did yes, just... yeah, he was available. In um, you know, it would have helped probably on the on the on the glass a little bit, uh, protecting the rim, but added uh, another uh, playmaker. I wanted to have another ball handler with versus their pressure, um, and obviously it didn't work. But that was the thought process. Without Devon in the lineup, it seems you've kind of had Denny as that, at least tonight anyway, as that ball handler with the second unit. What does he bring as a creator with that group? He's got a good feel. Um, you know, he's a good passer, plays pick and rolls well. I think he reads, you know, the defense pretty well. Um, you know, obviously positional size defensively, so uh, I think he's he's shown more than capable of being a primary facilitator for us. Yeah, I think he stepped out. Um, there were two looks on that play, um, and the first look was not open. Um, JP was open at the top, and I think we just we didn't see him, so he threw it to Kyle, and it was kind of tight to the sideline, so he stepped out. 